These are my favorite kind of videos. Dessert? <laughs> Dessert videos. We get to review another flavor from Lolly's. And here's the thing. You know, every time Lolly's comes out with a new flavor, I get really excited. But my two favorite flavors of cake prior to keto. Carrot cake. Carrot cake and German chocolate cake. Well, the last flavor they came out was... Carrot cake. Carrot cake. And now they've got a German chocolate cake. And I swear, I have nothing to do with lollies. Like, we're, it's, I'm not telling them what flavors to make. They're just reading my mind and saying that's say, the awesome flavor. They're reading your mail. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. So, like I said before, uh, yeah, my one of my favorite flavors of cake was German chocolate cake. After all, I'm German. Right, and every time you had a birthday, I either got you a carrot cake or we got German chocolate cake. There yeah. was Those were the two requests. And here, Lolly's has given us both. New flavor. So this is a brand new flavor of Lolly's Cookie Clusters. Now, if you don't know what this is like, we've done several videos. And uh, the last flavor that came out with was carrot cake. I'm going to leave a link for that up here. And we love them because they're super clean ingredients. They're very low total carb. Just a little spoiler for this video. A serving is three total carbs. Total carbs. Total. And so they, they're just a great little treat to put in our yogurt. They're great on top of ice cream, or they're great as I just want a little sweet something without overdoing it. Are you ready to try these? Yes, because it's from Lolly Lolly Lolly, get your adverbs here. Lolly Lolly Lolly, get your adverbs here. Lolly Lolly Lolly, got some adverbs here. Strawberry cheesecake bones. I put a higher strength on the I, do you taste it now? I taste it now. Yeah, you just gotta, with these flavored bones, if you're doing a grind your own, increase like the strength Make just a little bit. This is on setting four. Normally on the uh, Breville, we set it at three. So right now it's on He-Man. The only way that you can go up is maybe to, to take it up to She-Ra We can go up to level. 10. What would that be? I don't know. It'd be okay. like the Infinity Gauntlet level. Mm. Okay, There's a cake going on in there. We don't have the other camera set up because it's kind of like packed up getting ready for our camping trip. So we're not going to be able to show it to you. But Does it look like German chocolate cake? Oh my gosh, it looks like it German looks chocolate cake. It looks like German chocolate cake. cake. Wow. I'm so excited right now. Are you excited? I can just, I can see all of the ingredients in yep. here. We will put a close up picture of it here for you. They do not disappoint. Okay, so that is about a serving size. And again, we'll put up a little picture so you can see all the ingredients because you can see every ingredient And it's filled in here. up to the top. Yeah, this bag is full. Now, we've already had two big pieces, and you can see it is full to the top. So serving size is pretty generous, and there's eight servings in this bag, and it is very filling. It is like cake. Five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend? I feel like we should just like eliminate the how does it taste because we're telling you how it tastes ahead of time. Then we so it becomes redundant. I but. cannot like make my face not show you how I feel though. Right. Like I, I have a problem with that. So like if, Run the, away. if the product tastes terrible, you guys are gonna know it like right up front. Before we get to number three. Right. Okay, so number one, the ingredients. The ingredients in this are Georgia pecans. I taste them, all of them. Almond flour, organic erythritol, and a stevia blend, pure olive oil, cream cheese powder, organic sweet unsweetened coconut, 100% uh, unsweetened cacao powder cacao. and eggs. 
And yeah, I was wondering because these are moister than the other version. I mean, they're Sorry, all moist, but moist. these are moist. Very moist, like a delicious cake. But that's like a German chocolate cake. Like it's you're a expecting moist cake. that German chocolate moistness where it's like you almost like and you like you can squish it and see juices coming out. That's like this. That's exactly how it tastes. Yeah. Because German chocolate cake, it's almost like the icing is built in. Mm -hmm. Right? It's like one and the same. It, it is that good. Number two, does it keto based on a nutrition label? Well, let's check it out. So a serving size is 28 grams. There's eight servings in this bag. And again, it is pretty generous. Now we each probably ate about a half a serving and I showed you about, and again, that's without a scale or anything like that. But it's a pretty generous amount. You feel like satisfied having a serving. We have had enough lollies to know like how to eye it even. Yeah. So there's 177 calories per serving, 18 grams of fat, three grams of protein, three total carbs. And let me tell you, there is a lot of nuts in that, in each bite. Right. Two fiber for a total of one, one net, net carb, carb per serving. What I like about the ingredients, since we're kind of talking about the ingredients and the, you know, we're talking about the, you know, nutrition label. Notice it's three total carbs and two grams of dietary fiber. That other carb is coming from everything else. You're not getting a carb from erythritol. So they're saying there's erythritol in here, but there's not a lot. No. So you don't get that, that, you know, like cooling effect. No cooling effect. It's not overly sweet, but it's sweet enough. It's sweet like a cake is supposed to be, but it's a cake without all of the icing junk, but it's sweeter than a cake that doesn't have icing. Does that make any sense yeah, to you? Yeah, it does. Like it makes sense in my mind. Like you think about a piece of cake and a piece of cake is not very sweet no. until you put icing on it. So this is take a piece of cake, add a little bit of icing into the cake. An appropriate amount. An appropriate amount. So it's not overly sweet, but it's not like you're eating a cake with no icing. That I don't know. It, it sounds right in my head. It tastes like dessert. It does not taste like a breakfast muffin. Right. Right. So you've they've accomplished dessert instead of feeling like it's a trail mix. But it's probably not going to trigger a sweet tooth as much as eating like a piece of keto chocolate or something right. like that. Right. Exactly. Number three, how does it taste? I really don't think there's much to say here. It's incredible, but but something to say here, and it's kind of connected to the nutrition label, which is we found lately, you dice up things and you can make an ingredient stretch way further. And I think that they've got the perfect dicing of nuts because nuts are a problem for me. Mm -hmm. I overindulge in nuts because I enjoy the mouthfeel of nuts and the flavor of nuts. So in order for you to enjoy nuts but not like kill your carbs for the day, dicing them up makes them go further. So you're able to have nuts and, and the coconut in every single bite right. without blowing your day. And the thing that's amazing about this with the taste is one of the ingredients is olive oil, and olive oil's got a distinct taste. Yeah, it does. But you don't taste the olive oil because at all. Because recently, Joe accidentally made his avocado mayonnaise with olive oil. With olive oil, instantly knew that there was had something had to throw wrong. the whole batch out. So that's not what you taste here. The taste is incredible, and I love the consistency. So they call them cookie clusters because you could take this whole thing and make one giant ball, or you can break it up, but it doesn't crumble to the point where like you're having to pick it up like little piece by piece. It's it's the size you want. It's just the perfect consistency all the way around. Yeah. Number four, how much do they cost? Here we go. Um, they sell them, they have sales all the time. These obviously are not on sale right now. Uh, they're $15 a bag, which I really do not think is that bad. It comes out to be what, just over, just under $2 a serving. Which is pretty fair which for is keto right snacks. In the price of keto snacks, and again, Seeing the price of some of the even non-keto snacks, like I recently paid for a candy bar for Anthony and almost fell over when like a Twix bar was two dollars and fifty cents. I don't remember paying two dollars fifty cents for Twix either. bars before. But it puts it in perspective because a lot of times my initial reaction is like, I bet I'm paying way more for this product. But you're getting amazing ingredients, and honestly, it's not that much of a stretch between the top shelf non-keto things yep. that you enjoy. Now there is a link for them down below and we do have a coupon code which is 2 Crazy Ketos. I believe that gets you 10% off. 
And also, whenever they do have a sale, which is, I don't know, once pretty, every couple months. Yeah, pretty often. Um, whenever they do have a sale, you can always tack our coupon code on top of it. Now, if you're interested in this flavor, today is Thursday, the 20th, August 20th. Mm -hmm. These are coming out today, the day you're, that we're releasing this video. Friday. Which is Friday, August 21st at 8 a.m. So... That's why this video is up earlier than most of our other videos. So if you're seeing it early Friday morning. Good morning. Good morning. Have a great morning. These are releasing at 8 a.m. Use the link down below. And again, one of the things that we love about Lollies is that's why, because of the ingredients, because they're awesome people, they, everything is fresh. And that's why whenever we're doing a giveaway, they're one of the first companies that we call and yeah. say, well, hey, will you, will you sponsor us? Because we love your product. We absolutely love their product. And we love the ladies there. Yes. Oh my gosh. And like, it's a quality thing that we can feel good about because mm. we don't want to share even snacks with you that's going to derail your progress. Right. So we know that this is going to achieve like what you want, which is to enjoy some like great flavored dessert type options, right. but not do it where you're going to regret it tomorrow. Well, we're getting into number five. So let's actually do number five. Would we recommend it? And I, we touched a lot on it. Absolutely recommend it. I think it's great ingredients. I think it's great, like a good price. I think the nutrition label is awesome. I think the serving size is like a generous serving size, especially for like a dessert type food. And it's something that we have found to be super versatile. So obviously you can eat it exactly how it comes out of the bag, but we have used it to uh, top our ice cream. Pie crust. It makes a fantastic pie crust. And it also works really well as a crumble on things. So mm -hmm. this is something that you wanna take a look at. And this and all the uh, their sweet other flavors. Sweet potato casserole. If you make the Keto Connect sweet potato yep. casserole and then you crumble this on top, any of the flavors pretty much. Um, but you crumble that across the top instead of it using really like the candy it. pecans. It just elevates it to another level. So how cool would it be is if you've got a brand new uh, sweet potato casserole this fall season, and that's a German chocolate topped sweet potato casserole. Like yeah. you're talking amazing next level. Something people haven't tried before. Yeah. So yeah, absolutely would recommend it again. There's a link down below. Let us know down in the comment section if you've ever tried any of the lollies. If you have tried lollies, what is your favorite flavor? Because I'm kind of torn now. I mean, carrot cake... The, I think the all-time best one is the peanut butter macadamia. Oh my goodness, yes. But that carrot cake was pretty awesome. They nailed the flavor. But I feel like this one is going to top carrot cake now. I think it's really delicious. And honestly, this is going to be something that I reach for because it's going to satisfy my nut cravings, but it's not going to trigger my sweet tooth too badly. I mm -hmm. don't think so because it's sweet, but just enough. It's not something that's going to be like a sugar bomb in my mouth. And then now I'm going to have a problem for a week recovering. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's going to be our video for today. If you like seeing different types of product reviews, check out our complete product review playlist, which you can find right over there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent recent video, which you're going to find right over here. But whether you go in this direction or this direction, don't forget to do this. Hit the subscribe button down below, and that way you can be notified every single time we try something delicious. Until next time. Bye. bye.